Stop hurting me! Secrets and lies! The monkeys cry! Secrets and lies! The monkeys cry! Freedom for monkeys! I want to get out of here. Hi, I'm Jane Velez Mitchell for Jane Unchained in South Florida. As you can see, there is a sizable demonstration going on here over what's been dubbed Monkey Gate, a secret plan to turn a rural county, Hendry County, into the laboratory monkey breeding capital of America. That secret has now been exposed, triggering global outrage. These demonstrators, the vast majority from Florida, say they want Hendry County's commissioners to make it stop and send these lab monkey breeding facilities home. So Julie Watkins from the Girls Gone Green, we are coming all the way down from Jacksonville, Florida, because we know that this is not just a county issue, it's a statewide issue, and beyond that, it could be a national issue. I've been doing meteorology for 15 years, and the question is not if a tropical storm, depression, or hurricane will hit the area, it's when. So what precautions do they have in place in case some kind of natural disaster happens and all these monkeys get loose? This is a dangerous, cruel business. It is bringing shame on the community and on the state of Florida. PETA did an undercover investigation. Workers violently handled the monkeys, terrorizing them by grabbing their sensitive tails and lunging at them with nets. Subjects monkeys to cruel, invasive surgeries, doing things like cutting the fetuses out of pregnant mothers and selling them. Live monkeys are sold to laboratories to be used in cruel medical experiments. This was not done with the community's approval. I cannot understand how you could choose a business over the life of your your own children, your grandchildren, your great-grandchildren. The Henry County Commission meeting that followed the demonstration was packed with critics who did not hold back. Human beings were given something called consciousness, which means you know right from wrong. I can't qualify you as human beings because obviously you do not know right from wrong. You probably thought in time we would go away. However, as you can see, we have not and will not. They confronted the commissioners about their decision to approve facilities without first holding public hearings, something that is now the subject of a lawsuit. It's a mile and a half from me. I, I do all my horseback riding back there, and all of a sudden I see all this land being destroyed. This is a beautiful parcel of land. I mean, oak trees and old Florida back there. It's gorgeous. And I see it all being mowed down, tractored down. Dust, dust. So I happened to ask somebody there. I said, what's going on back here? They said, they're building a monkey facility. I said, what? Taxpayers and residents never got a say in making Hendry County number one in primate abuse. What happens to the tons of waste that will go into the aquifer? And what happens when the animals escape, which they will at some point? PETA, People for the Ethical Treatment of Animals, has eyewitness accounts of numerous examples of violence and neglect of these animals. Hard-hearted. You have to be hard-hearted people not to have already done something about this situation. It's a mile and a half from my house. Contaminated feces and urine is not something I want to have myself and my children and my grandchildren exposed to. We kill the environment, we kill the nature, we kill the water. This article goes on to say that 29% of a group of monkeys had this deadly strain of diarrhea. The monkeys bred in Hendry County are going to be sold to labs and the labs are paying for those monkeys with federal grants. This is our money that's being spent on these monkeys. It's being spent on cruelty and bad science. Uh, when I worked at the lab, I really could not believe some of the studies that were being conducted. Um, just one example, there was an experiment that was supposed to be up about autism. They would separate baby monkeys from their mothers for hours at a time and then reunite them. The helpless infants cried, the mothers cried, and I never understood the point. Autism is not caused by maternal neglect or sending your kids to daycare. Um, they, but they got a grant to do it. A PETA investigation has revealed that for decades, a National Institutes of Health laboratory in Maryland has confined hundreds of monkeys, bred dozens of babies each year to be predisposed to mental illness, torn many away from their mothers at birth, and tormented them for their entire lives in cruel and archaic psychological experiments. Both ethically and morally, these experiments have no place in science today. We voted for, for you because we care. 
and we thank that you are wonderful people. Please prove us right. Were you impacted? Can I ask you that question? Were Absolutely. you impacted? Absolutely. You were? Okay, thank you. Shut it down, please. Do the right thing.